Oh! Oh my god! He's nuts. He's legit nuts. <laughs> what a complete nightmare. Oh. Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Kabir Considers. In this video, I'm going to react to the movie The Big Lebowski. Now, this movie has been on my list for a long, long time. It's on the IMBD's top 100, no, top 250 movies. It's got Jeff um, Bridges, who I loved in Iron Man. He was Obadiah Stane in Iron Man. It's got Steve Buscemi, who was in Reservoir Dogs, great actor, and The Sopranos. It's got Julianne Moore. It's got, I'm sure I'm forgetting someone else. Like the cast here, yeah, John Goodman. I recognize him from something as well. So it's gotta be a good movie. Like, you know, based on 800,000 votes, it's got an 8.1, which is a really high score. And that's probably putting it in like the top, probably the top 1% of movies, you know, ever. I've got no idea what it's about, genuinely. The only thing I know is that a friend of mine at uni, at university, used to just randomly shout out, shut the F up, Donny. Like, and I'm guessing that was from the movie. So uh, other than that, I literally know nothing about this movie. Um, oh, actually, I know one more thing. Someone in the comment section for the Apocalypto reaction that I did, mentioned that this is filmed in Utah and she is also from Utah so yeah hopefully this lives up to expectations I reckon it's going to be good you know so yeah let's do it okay the way out west there was this fella fella I want to tell you about a fella by the name of Jeff Lebowski Lebowski. At least that was the handle his loving parents gave. <laughs> so I've been saying it wrong. It's Lebowski, he not Lebowski. Himself. This Lebowski, he called himself the Dude. The Dude? Uh, dude. That's a name no one would self-apply where I come from. <laughs> they call Los Angeles the City of Angels. I didn't find it to be that exactly. But I don't know there are some nice folks there. Of course, I can't say I've seen London. And I've never been to France. Come over, mate. You like and it. I ain't never seen no queen in her damn dundies, as the fella said. But I'll tell you what. After seeing Los Angeles, and this is here story I'm about to unfold, uh, I guess I've seen something every bit as stupefying as you'd seen in any of those <laughs> other places. I'm excited. And in English, too. So I can die with a smile on my face without feeling like the good Lord gypped me. <laughs> that now, tumbleweed's been going for a while. Unfold, took place back in the early 90s, just about the time of our conflict with Saddam and the Iraqis. I only mention it because sometimes there's a man. I think that's the guy. A hero. Because what's a hero? But sometimes there's a man. And I'm talking about the dude here. Sometimes there's a man. Uh, I love how he's casually his shopping place. in a bathing bathroom. Right in, and that's the dude. In Los Angeles. And even if he's a lazy man, <laughs> and the dude was most certainly that, quite possibly the laziest in Los Angeles County. Really? Which would place him high in a running for lazy. Dude, you can't ride. drink, you can't open up the carton. Sometimes without there's pain? a man. Sometimes there's a man. Wow. Lost my train of thought here. I done introduced him enough. No way. He wrote a check for a carton of milk. That's uh, that was George Bush Senior, weren't it? I mean, who writes a check for sixty-nine cents? Oh, who's this guy? Oh! Oh my God! Oh my God! Where's the money, Lebowski? Oh, debt collectors. Where's the money, Lebowski? Where's the money, Lebowski? Where's the fucking money, shithead? It's down there somewhere. Let me take another look. <laughs> With us. Your wife owes money to Jackie Treehorn. That means you owe money to Jackie Treehorn. Oh, no. There are thus the deadbeats, Lebowski. Is he taking a leak in his living room? Duh. Not on the rug, man. See? See what happens? Oh, come Nobody on. Nobody me Lebowski. You got the wrong guy. I'm the dude, man. <sighs> Your name's Lebowski, Lebowski. Your wife is Bunny. My wife, Bunny, do you see a wedding ring on my finger? Does this place look like I'm fucking married? 
Oh, God. Give those a wash first. What the fuck is this? Obviously, you're not a golfer. What the? That's yeah. the biggest golf ball I've ever seen. More like a bowling ball. Yeah, what do you think? Oh, they got the wrong like guy. Fucking loser. Hey, at least I'm housebroken. <laughs> Thanks a lot, asshole. Damn. You're not getting that money. Interesting start. So, I'm guessing he's basically like a middle-aged bachelor or something like that. Just living life. Ooh, nice strike, my guy. Man, I love bowling. I, I need to go more. I'm not very good, but I just love throwing that bowling ball. Yeah, these guys are killing it. I'm throwing rocks tonight. Mark it, dude. Yeah, man, it really tied the room together. So this was a valued... Uh, okay, so these are the dude's boys. My rug. Were you listening to the dude's story, Donnie? What? Walter. I was bowling. So you have no frame of reference here, Donnie. No, Walter, <laughs> what's the point? There's no Give reason. Give me Donnie a hard point, time. Dude. There's no fucking reason why these... Yeah, Walter, what's your point? Huh? Look, we all know who is at fault here. What the fuck are you talking about? Huh? <laughs> no, what the fuck are you... We're talking about unchecked aggression here, What the dude. fuck is he talking my about? My rug. Forget Look, it, Donnie. You're out of your element. Walter, the Chinaman <laughs> who peed on my rug. Donnie's just getting shot on. So what the fuck are you talking about? Chinaman is not the preferred nomenclature. Asian American, please. Walter, this isn't a guy who built the railroads here. This is a guy. What the fuck are you talking about? What are they talking about right now? Peed on the dude's rug. Donnie, you're out of your element, dude. <laughs> The China You're out of your element. <laughs> Walter's Lebowski, hilarious. The other Jeffrey Lebowski, the millionaire. So that there's no reason, there's no fucking reason why his wife should go out and owe money all over town and then they come and they pee on your fucking rug. Am I wrong? No. Am I wrong? That rug really tied the room together, did it? Man, I really... I'm, I'm not following this so far. Please. The you story know, they're the telling. I could find this fucking Lebowski guy. Oh, so they're talking Lebowski. about finding That's Lebowski. Name, gotcha. This is the guy who should the rich me guy. For the fucking rug. Gotcha. His wife goes out and owes money all over town, and they pee on my rug. Yeah, that I was just. Ugh. Rug. Jeffrey Lebowski. Is very impressive. Okay, okay so this must be the that. rich Lebowski then, not this guy. That is the key to the city of Pasadena, which Mr. Lebowski received two years ago. In wow. Of it. That's ah, the this guy, Philip Seymour Hoffman, which is right? Given, well, not necessarily is, somebody. This, is this him with uh, Nancy? Yes, indeed, that is Mr. Lebowski with the First Lady, yes. Uh, in fact, he met privately with the President, though unfortunately there wasn't enough time for a photo opportunity. Oh. Aha! Okay, so you're a Lebowski, I'm a Lebowski. That's terrific. But I am very busy, as I imagine you are. What can I do for you, sir? Well, uh, they were they were looking for you, these two guys. I know what happened. Yes, yes. Did I urinate on your rug? <laughs> you mean, <laughs> did you personally come and pee on my rug? Hello. No, like I said, woo, or peed on my rug. I just want to understand. Every time a rug is mitterated upon in this fair city, I have to compensate the person. Come on, man. But it was it was your wife he was here. after. Are you employed, Mr. Lebowski? I am not Mr. Lebowski. No, mm. this aggression will not stand, man. Dude, you I think you're about to get thrown out. My wife is not the issue here. I cannot solve your problem, sir. Only you can. Oh, fuck it. Oh, fuck it. Yes, that's your answer. Your revolution is over, Mr. Lebowski. The bomb's lost. One. <laughs> My advice to you is to do what you <laughs> get a job, sir. Do you hear me, Lebowski? He's such an asshole. <laughs> He's still yelling. <laughs> the old man told me to take any rug in the house. Oh, wow. Well, enjoy. Oh, nice. And perhaps we'll see you again sometime, dude. Nice. Yeah, sure. Uh, I'm in the neighborhood. You Who's know, this? And, uh... Lana. Wow. Hello. You want me to blow on your uh, coat? Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, my God. Is that the other Lebowski's daughter? Dude. Are you sure he won't mind? Who he doesn't care about anything. You're not blowing. Our guest has to be getting along, Mrs. Lebowski. Oh. Mrs. Lebowski? Your bunny. So that's the wife. Suck your cock for a thousand dollars. Oh, hello. <laughs> <laughs> Brian can't watch, though. Or he has to pay a hundred. <laughs> <laughs> that's marvelous. I love his pained laughter. Uh, I 
I'm just gonna go find a cash machine. So she's the reason his rug got peed on. <laughs> Slamming him tonight. You guys are dead in the water. Fucking 20 minutes late, man. What the fuck is that? Carrier. What's in the fucking carrier? Hmm? Looks like a dog, right? Oh, Cynthia's dog. Like yeah. it's Pomeranian. Can't leave him home alone or he eats the furniture. Pomeranian. Oh, about Cynthia and Marty Ackerman. Popular in Australia. Man, if my fucking ex-wife asked me to take care of her fucking dog while she and her boyfriend went to Honolulu, I'd tell her to go fuck herself. Why can't you board it? First of all, dude, you don't have an ex. Secondly, this is a fucking show dog with fucking papers. Over the line! Huh? I'm sorry, Smokey. You were over the line. That's a foul. Bullshit. Market eight, dude. Uh, excuse me. Market zero. Next friend. Walter is. Bullshit. He is Walter. hilarious. Market eight, dude. This is bowling. There are rules. Hey, Walter, come on. Did he just say this is a knob? So his toe slipped over a little. You know, it's just a. This is a league game. This determines who enters the next round robin. Am I wrong? Give me the marker, dude. I'm marking an eight. Oh God. Are they about to Looking kick off? Friend. Really? You're entering a world of pain. Walter, what the hell? I'm not. A world of pain. <laughs> he pulled out a gun. The whole world got crazy! Am I the only one around here who gives a shit about the rules? What the hell? zero! They're calling the cops, man. Put the people They're calling in. the cops! Walter! Walter. I can't I believe- Whoa! What the hell? Is this happening right now? <laughs> Right, zero. He pulled a piece out and he cocked it back. Elite game smoking. He's unhinged. You can't do that, man. He is unhinged. They're like me, they're pacifists. He's got emotional problems, man. I did not know that. Well, he doesn't care uh, at all. Under the, do you enter the next round, Robin? Am I wrong? No, you're not wrong. Am I wrong? You're not wrong, Walter. You're just an asshole. <laughs> okay then. He's not wrong like either. And next week, they should be over. The cops, oh man. Just take it easy, man. Pacifism is not... Look at our current situation with that camel fucker in Iraq. Pacifism <laughs> is not something to hide behind. Just take it easy, man. I'm perfectly calm, dude. <laughs> yeah, waving the fucking gun around? Mr. Lebowski, this is Brand at, uh, well, at Mr. Lebowski's office. He wants his rug back. He wants the rug. Mr. Lebowski, this is Bell Zonaker of the Southern Cal Bowling League. An informal report that a member of your team drew a firearm during league play. Why did he do that? This is true, of course, it contravenes a number of the league's bylaws and also Article 27 of the league. Who's Dude. at the door? Hey, Marty. Dude, I, I, f I finally got I got the uh, the venue I wanted. I'm performing my dance quintet, you know, my cycle at Crane Jackson's Fountain Street Theater on Tuesday night. And what uh, is the dude drinking I'd there? I'd love it if you came and gave me notes. I'll be there, man. Uh, dude, uh, tomorrow's already the tenth. Far out. Oh, oh, all right, okay. Just, uh, just slip the rent under my door. Oh, that's his landlord. Okay. And the dude owes him money. How's he gonna get the money? Mr. Lebowski, rant again. Please do call us as soon as you get in and I'll send the limo. I hope you're not avoiding this call because of the rug. You're not getting the rug back. Which I assure you is not a problem. Ah. We need your help and, uh, well, we would very much like to see you. Oh, ah, interesting. So it's not about the rug. We've had some terrible news. Mr. Lebowski is in seclusion in the West Wing. What's happened? What's wrong with uh, Mr. Lebowski? Lebowski too. Funny. I can look back on a life of achievement, challenges met. God, is he about to start invested, like shitting on overcome. the dude again? Bunny, excuse me. She is the light of my life. <clears throat> <laughs> Why is he crying? Received this fax this morning. The wife. She, she left him. See. Right. It is a ransom note. Oh, kidnapped. We have bunny. Written by men who are unable to achieve on a level field of Gather play. one million dollars. Is, is the dude going to try and find her and claim the bounty? Instructions or something. No funny. This is a bummer, man. That's uh, Rat will fill you in on the details. So he wants him to go after her, for sure. I mean, you know. She should just be able to pay what she owes. He is prepared to make a generous offer to you to act as courier once we get instructions for the money. Really? What do you mean, man? He believes the culprits might be the very people who uh, soiled your rug and right. you're in a unique position to confirm or disconfirm that suspicion. He Dude, the take his money. Well, Why not? We just don't know. <laughs> wow, look at this guy. What an outfit. What, what even is that? Is that a jumpsuit? 
Why is he licking the... <laughs> Man, I think I'm gonna head to my nearest bowling alley. If you get to see characters like this... What a character. I don't even know what to think. Walter, I bet, hates his guts. That creep can roll, man. Yeah, but he's a pervert, dude. <laughs> Is he? What makes no, him a perv? He's a sex offender with a record. Oh it's my god. It's a Chino for exposing himself to an eight year old. Oh god. When he moved to Hollywood, he had to go door to door to tell everyone he was a petter ass. Oh. What's a petter ass, Walter? Shut the fuck up, Donnie. <laughs> Donnie, just get it. So, 20 grand, man. And oh. of course, I still get to keep the rug. Just for making the hand up? Yeah. 20 grand. Of, uh, do the beeper. Cash money. Also, whenever these guys call. What if it's during a game? She probably kidnapped herself. Rug Piers did not do this. A young trophy wife. Mm. She owes money all over town. That fairly plausible. That uh, fucking bitch. Oh, yeah. That makes me fucking sick. What are they what are doing? doing? The point is. Are you Lord. ready to be fucked, man? I see you roll your way into the semis. Dios mío, man. Liam and me, we're gonna fuck you up. Oh my god. Yeah, well. Let me tell you something, Pandeo. Pandeo. You pull any of your crazy shit with us, you flash a piece out on the lanes. I'll take it away from you and stick it up your ass and pull the fucking trigger oh. till it goes click. Oh. Nobody fucks with the Jesus. Eight year olds, dude. Yeah, that's to be fair, there's no getting past that. What the? What the heck? Whoa! What now? How does the dude live, like, because he hasn't got a job. Like, where is he getting money from to, like, pay rent and buy groceries and stuff and go bowling? <laughs> what the heck is this montage? Is this okay? I'm guessing he's having like a dream because he's like being knocked out. This is pretty cool, to be fair. Did that even happen? Did he actually just get punched? I think it was all just a dream, weren't it? Minutes ago, they want you to take the money, drive north on the 405. One person only. They were very clear on that, or I'd go with you. One person only. Here's the money. Her life is in your hands, dude. All right, dude, you got to step up now. They're paying you 20 G's. And he's taking Walter. He said one person only. Come on, man. Take the ringer. I'll drive. What? what the hell is this? Has he swapped out the money? Dirty undies, dude. Laundry. The whites. Walter. Oh, I'm sure there's a no. reason you brought you. The ringer cannot look empty. Walter, what the fuck are you thinking, man? He You're wants right, to dude. keep the money. I got the thing. Dude, is why should we settle for 20 grand when we can keep the entire million? Am I wrong? Yes, oh, you're wrong. This man. isn't a fucking game, man. Oh, but it is a game. You said so yourself. Oh, Walter. You yourself. I see what you're I thinking, but phone. no. Who is this? Dude, the bag man. Man, where do you want us to go? Us? Oh, <sighs> Oh, God, he's given himself up already. Yeah, you know, uh, me and the driver. Uh, I'm not uh, handling the money, driving the car, and talking on the phone all by myself. Shut the fuck up! Dude, are you fucking this up? Who is that? Oh, Walter, shut That is the driver. I told you. Oh, man. The shut deal's off the already, isn't it? Walter, the deal's going to be cool, though. We hung up, man. Her life was in our hands, man. Easy. We're screwed now. We don't get shit. They're going to... Kill her. Walter ruined it in like Fuck five Walter. minutes. Nothing is fucked, dude. Come on. You're being very undude. She kidnapped her. You see? Nothing's fucked here, dude. Nothing is fucked. Just They're don't say anything. Don't say people. I'm doing business here, man. Okay, dude. Have it your way. But they're amateurs. <sighs> oh! Dude. Okay, we proceed, but only if there's no funny stuff. Yeah, yeah. So no funny stuff, okay? Hey. Just say no funny tell stuff. Tell me where the fuck you want us to go. That was the sign, man. All we're gonna do is get her back. No one's in a position to complain. We keep the back sheesh. Walter, they're obviously gonna the check off. the suitcase. Right, grab one. There's one thing I learned in Nam. Dude. You okay? 
coming to a wooden bridge. When you cross the bridge, you throw the bag from the left window of the moving car. You're being watched. You're being watched. What do you say? Where's that? There is Dude. no fucking handoff, man. At the wooden bridge, we throw the money out of the car. They're obviously going to check the we case the for money the money out of the moving car. Okay, dude, the bridge is coming up. Give me the ringer. Chop, chop. Okay, dude, no time to argue. Hey, man, the bridge. Oh, chill, Walter. Chill, chill. No. No. What the fuck? Okay, dude, your wheel. Hey, hey, 15 MPH, I roll out. I double back. I grab one of them and beat it out of him. The Uzi. He's nuts. He's legit nuts. <laughs> what a nightmare. What a complete nightmare. Oh, oh my god. What a mess. Let's go bowling. And they actually went bowling. What do you say now? What do you say to them? Because it was all your fault, really. What the fuck are we going to tell Lebowski? Huh? What exactly is the problem? What the do you problem? mean, what's the problem? Your wife's still missing. They're going to kill that poor woman, man. Poor slut kidnapped herself. Come on. Dude. Oh, oh man. I said I thought she kidnapped herself. You were Nothing's ever Walter's certain. fault. That's right, dude. Poor oh, fucking shot. Oh, fuck. I, that's it. I'm out of here. They're not going to kill shit. They're not going to do shit. What can they do? They're a bunch of fucking amateurs. And meanwhile, look at the bottom line. But how do you know that they're amateurs, Walter? Dollars. Sitting in the trunk of our car. Our what car, they got? Walter. My dirty undies. My fucking wife. What just happened? What's happened? What are they looking at? Where is your car? You don't know, Walter? You fucking know it's been stolen. Oh, fuck it. Uh, tape deck and Creedence taped, and there was a, uh, uh, my briefcase. My rug was also stolen. Your rug was in the car? No, here. Separate incidents. Mr. Lebowski, I'd like to see you. Call when you get home and I'll send a car for you. My name is Maud Lebowski. I'm the one who took your rug. Oh. I guess we can close the file on that one. <laughs> the plot thickens. What the heck? What's that sound? What the heck? <laughs> Why doesn't she have any undies on? Oh, isn't she the, uh, the, the woman who's with the guy who punched him in the jaw? Yes, I know all about it, and I know that you acted as courier. Let me tell you something. The whole thing stinks to high heaven. Right, but, but let me explain something about the rug. Do you like sex, Mr. Lebowski? Whoa. Excuse me? I was talking about my rug. You're not interested in sex? Uh, you know, I don't see what this has to do with, uh... Take a look at this, sir. Hmm? Oh, I know that guy. Who's this guy? Uh, he's a nihilist. Oh, yeah, the guy from the pool, right? Carl Hungus. And the dispatcher says there's something wrong with Dinah Carver. That's why they sent me. I am an expert. Oh, God. Are we watching... Uh, you recognize uh, her, of course. And... Starts with a P, ends in O. I can't say it, otherwise it will trigger oh, the thingy. Right, okay. Lord. You can imagine where it goes from here. I am one of the two trustees of the Lebowski Foundation, the other being my father. The foundation takes youngsters from Watts and Shit, yeah, the achievers. Mm. Little Lebowski urban achievers, yes, and proud we are of all of them. Little I Lebowski asked my father urban about achievers. I a million dollars from the foundation account, and he told me about this abduction. Yeah, but my... So I'm proposing that you mm. try to recover the money from the people you delivered it to. What? Oh. Is he going to get paid again? To do the job that he didn't do in the first place. So I will compensate you to the tune of ten percent of the recovered sum. Oh. What about my uh... Your rug? Yes. Well, with that money, you can buy any number of rugs that don't have sentimental value for me. Here's the name and number of a doctor who will look at it for you. You will receive no bill. He's a good man. Oh. That, that, that's She's making it right. See him, Jeffrey. He's a good man and thorough. I gotta tell you, Don, man. Earlier today, I was really feeling shitty, man. Really down in the dumps. Lost oh, mate, money. this is making you me want to ride in a limo. Forget about it, huh? I've only Forget been in a limo it. once. Yeah, uh, home sweet home, Mr. Rell. Look at, look at the dude getting rides, hey. you know, in a limo and free drinks. And, huh? Oh, they're being followed. Yeah, he followed us. He started oh, man, not again. Oh, man. Where is my goddamn money, you bum? 
You bum! Well, I don't... They did not receive the money, you nitwit! We dropped off the damn money. Man, I've got certain mm. information, all right? Certain things have come to light, and she kidnapped herself. I'm saying she needs money. Mm. Okay, you know. They're you buying it. You to all the new shit, so... Hey, that's what you, uh, that's what you pay me for. <laughs> Do you think uh, that you could uh, give me my 20000 in cash? Oh, my, uh, my God. My concern is... And I've wow, got he's actually asking account, for the money. This might... Give him the envelope. We received this this morning. Since you have stolen my money. Oh God, what are they doing? Since you have unrepentedly betrayed my trust. Oh no. I have no choice to tell these bums to do whatever is necessary to recover their oh, money my gosh. from you. This ain't looking good. Oh, gotcha. Oh. I will not abide another toe. Whose toe was it, Walter? What the fuck should I know? Walter, now, the point is, you're gonna we... kill her. Walter, and then they're gonna kill me. Me to be a series of victimless crimes. What about the toe? Forget about the fucking toe! <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Dude, don't He's a go psycho. away, man. Come He's on, nuts. This affects all of us, man. Mr. Lebowski, this is duty officer Rollbog of the LAPD. Oh. They found the car. For a fucking hour. Oh, God. But is there money in there? Who just busted in the hat? Oh, my God. Oh, for God's sake. Who's this? Hey, hey, this is a private residence, man. Who the hell is this? Oh, it's that guy from the bathtub. <laughs> ah, so these are the kidnappers, huh? You think we are kidding? And tomorrow we come back and we cut off your Johnson. Sink a bad set, the bus. He's not having a good time. The money's gone. The money's gone, isn't it? Oh, my fucking briefcase, man! It's not here! Damn. I could be sitting here with just pee stains on my rug. Fucking Nazis. Oh! Man, they were nihilists, man. Huh? They kept saying they believed in nothing. Fuck me. We are sympathizing here, dude. Fuck sympathy. I don't need your fucking sympathy, man. I need my fucking Johnson. What do you need that for, dude? You've got to buck What do you mean, man. what do you need that you for? You drag this negative energy into the tournament. Fuck the tournament. Fuck you, Walter. Fuck the tournament? Come on, Donnie. Let's go get us a lane. Call for you, dude. Jeffrey, you have not gone to the doctor. Uh, I'd like to see you immediately. So, you're Lebowski. She'll be back in a minute. Sit down. Looks like your mother really was kidnapped after all. She most certainly was not. She's most definitely the perpetrator and not the victim. I got pretty definitive evidence. From who? Stepmom, I From guess. Do so. you remember Uli? Mm. He's a musician. He used to have a group, Autobahn. So he's pretending to be the abductor. Well, yeah. Pretending? I don't think he was pretending. Really the whole idea is that the hostage can't be able to identify you after you've let them go. Mm. I know that. <laughs> <laughs> this guy is so the fuck is with weird. This guy? Who is he? So Uli has the money. Well, uh, no, not exactly. Uh, it... Do you still have that doctor's number? <laughs> oh no, really? It's Why a... is she so I insistent on, on him oh, going Jeffrey, to the doctor? I don't want to be responsible for any delayed after effects. Dime Sandro. After effects. After effects. See? Have they done something to him without him knowing? Maybe there's something in the drinks. Could you slide your shorts down, Mr. Lebowski, please? No, no, man. She hit me right here. I understand. Could you slide your shorts down, please? Why? What the heck is going on, man? Did they put something up there? Like a tracking device? He's being followed again. Same dude as before. Yep, he's definitely following you. For sure. Oh, no. Oh no, dude, don't crash. Ah, not again. <laughs> Where's he gone? He was literally just there a second ago. Oh, here we go. Louisiana, purchase my Lucy LaBelle? So, that looks like an essay or something. I thought it was maybe like a, a note that they, the burglar of his car left him. Is this the uh, the landlord? Yeah, his landlord, right? 
Wow, what is going on here? This is uh, quite unusual. He lives in North Hollywood on Radford near the In-N-Out Burger. Well, the In-N-Out Burger's on Camrose. Near the In-N-Out Burger. Those are good burgers, Walter. Shut the fuck up, <laughs> Donnie. Kid is in ninth grade, dude. And his father is... Are you ready for How hasn't sir? Donnie punched him in the face Arthur yet? Arthur Digby Sellers. Have you ever heard of a little show called Branded, dude? Fucking Arthur Digby Sellers wrote 156 episodes, dude. Why are they after this Arthur Digby exactly Sellers guy? Lightweight. And yet his son is a fucking dunce. Anyway, uh, we'll go there after the uh, what have you. Our fucking troubles are over, dude. They're not, are they? <laughs> Walter's just going to make it worse. You just know it. He's been of literally no help so far. Oh, fuck me, man. That kid's already spent all the money, man. My name is Walter Sobchak. This is my associate, Jeffrey Lebowski. Don't let Walter do the talking. Uh, we came to talk about little Larry. Sweetie, sit down. Uh, this man is the police. This is Larry. So they think he stole the car and took the money. Yep. Is this your homework, Larry? Just ask him about the car, man. Is this yours, Larry? Where's the fucking money, you little brat? Uh, Have you ever heard of Vietnam? Oh, You're all right. Hey, son, we know that this is your homework. All right. This is pointless. It's time for plan B. Oh, God. What's he going to do? This is what happens when you fuck a stranger in the ass. <laughs> you see what happens, Larry? Oh, God. <gasps> you see oh, what happens? no. This is what happens when you fuck a stranger in the ass, Larry. Oh, no. It's his Stop car. What the fuck are you doing, man? Stop oh, it! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm gonna hey, fucking I'm kill sorry. you! I just fought the fucking car last week! Come on, man. I'll kill your fucking car, man! Oh, hey, 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 that's not his head! Ah, no, no. God damn it! Oh, fuck you! No. You like that? Fuck you! How is Walter just casually eating a burger after getting the dude's car destroyed? Just no guilt whatsoever. I accept your apology. No, I just I just want to handle it by myself from now on. Yeah. Yeah, I'll be at practice. <laughs> and he's still going to practice. If that was me, I probably couldn't see Walter for a little while. I'd probably need to take a little time off that friendship. Who's this? Oh god. Put your diapers on Lebowski. Oh man. Jackie Treehorn wants to see you. All right, so this is the the big Hello, boss. Hello, dude. I'm Jackie Treehorn. The debt guy, the the loan shark dude. How's the smart business, Jackie? I wouldn't know, dude. I deal in publishing. You know, people forget that the brain is the biggest erogenous zone. Well, here it is, dude. Where's Bunny? Well, I thought you might know that, man. Why would I? She only ran off to get away from that rather sizable debt to me. I know you're mixed up in all this, dude. And I don't care what you're trying to get from the husband. Oh, man. That's your business. Yeah, all right, man. I mean, you know, there are a lot of um, facets uh, to this, a lot of interested parties. Um, Excuse me. Imagine, all of this started because of a rug. Because of literally a carpet. <laughs> yeah, where's that? What's this? Is that his ring or something, or what? Don't get caught snooping. Wow. <laughs> So, uh, if I, uh, can't find your money, uh, what's in it for the dude? Your money is being held by a kid named Larry Sellers. Write me a check for my 10% of half a million, five grand. I'll go out and mingle. 10% of half a million is not five grand. <laughs> oh, God, he's been drunk. You're a Caucasian Yankee. Uh-oh. 15-year-old kid. Oh, no joke. The funny stuff, Jack. It's not looking it's good. Not, not looking good, dude. Fellas, you just wanted a car. Oh man, he spilled it on the dude rug. Ever that ain't gonna come out easily. Oh. Uh, uh, oh my god. Uh, Coming to cut off the uh, the Johnson, eh? Uh, Nightmarish. Uh, oh. Now, is this real or is this still part of the the trip? No, this is real. He is high as a kite, as a kite. I want a fucking lawyer, man. 
Mr. Treehorn tells us that he had to eject you from his garden party. Now, we got a nice, quiet little beach community here, and I aim to keep it nice and quiet. Oh, my God! Ah! Stay out of Malibu, Lebowski! Ow! Stay out of Malibu, deadbeat! Oh, my God. Keep... Oh, dude. Jesus, man, could you change the channel? <laughs> Is he going to kick him out for that? He's kicking him out for that? For saying he doesn't like the eagles. Wow, man, this is crazy. He's not having the best, uh, the best week, is he? Hold on, what the heck? She's meant to be kidnapped right now. There you go, and she's got all her toes. Imagine if Walter was actually right all along. All along. Oh, Jesus. And they've trashed this place. Who's this? Oh. Jeffrey, love me. What the? Uh, that's my robe. Much to tell wow, you. so they're doing the deed. I, um... Oh, they've done the deed. I was uh, one of the authors of the Port Huron Statement. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to your house? Oh, Jackie Treehorn trashed the place. It's not my father's money, it's the foundation's. Why did he think you have it? Oh, Larry Sellers, high school kid, real fucking brat. You know, he doesn't have the money. Very complicated case, Ma. A lot of ins, a lot of outs. No, he runs stuff. Uh, we know. did let him run one of the companies briefly, but he didn't do very well at it. Oh, he wow. No, he helps administer the charity. So the other Lebowski now, isn't the I, I big shot success he says he is. Allowance. He has no money of his own. I know how he likes to present himself. Father's weakness is vanity. No Hence way. The slut. Uh. Was that yoga? It increases the chances of conception. Conception? What did you think this was all about? Fun and games? What the? I, want a I don't want a partner. In fact, I don't want the father to be someone I have to see socially or who have any interest in raising the child himself. Wow. So that doctor. She literally just um, used exactly. him. So your father. Yeah, I get it. Yeah, yeah. What? Oh, man, my thinking about this case has become very uptight. Yeah. So he's behind Jeffrey. it. Dude? Yeah, listen, Walter, I'm at my place. I need you to come pick me up. This guy get again. Get out of that fucking car, man. Get out of the fuck. Who the fuck are hey, you, man? man? My name is Davino. I'm a private snoop like you, man. Who are you working for? The Knutsons. Bunny Lebowski, man. Her real name is Fawn Knutson. Her parents want her back. So. Oh, I see. Oh, Christ. Crazy, huh? She's been kidnapped, the Fino. Oh, man, that's Well, oh, I don't know. Maybe not, but she's definitely not around. Professional Walter? Courtesy. That's Walter, right? Computers, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, I get it. Fuck off, the Fino. And stay away from my special, from my fucking lady friend, man. Uh, These guys are good. Solingerberry pancakes. How fucking arschloch. Linkenberry pancakes. It's the picks and blankets. The Michael kind of beer fun stuff. The Solingerberry pancakes. It's done with. Snap up some shit. Oh, so it was uh, someone else's toe. I mean, we totally fucked it up, man. We, I'm saying that if he knows I'm a fuck up, why does he leave me in charge of getting his wife back? He doesn't fucking want her back, man. But then, why doesn't he give a shit about his million bucks? Mm, the million bucks there was, no was never million in the bucks. briefcase. The asshole was hoping that they would kill her. Chill out. Oh, that was her car. Ah, where was she, man? Visiting friends of hers in Palm Springs, she just picked up and left, never bothered to tell us. Oh, man. This is all his fault. Hello, he's back. Where's the fucking money, Lebowski? You have your story, I have mine. I say I entrusted the money to you, and you stole it. Look at that fucking phony dude pretending to be a fucking millionaire. Out of this house now, you bums! I've seen a lot of spinals, dude. And this guy's a fake. Oh. A fucking gold breaker. Stay away from me, mister! Oh. This guy fucking walks. I've never been more certain of anything no in my life. No way. Stay away from me! Walter Is he faking? Is he faking? Put him down, Oh, man. my God. Yeah, put him oh, God. I did, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Walter, you are something else. 
Come on, man. Help me put him back in his chair. <laughs> oh, gosh. Wow. Oh. Oh, no, Donny. Sure, you'll see some tank battles. But fighting in desert is very different from fighting in canopy jungle. This is not a worthy hey! officer. What's this day of rest shit? What's this bullshit? I don't fucking care. Chill. It don't matter. My you don't fool Jesus. Yeah. I would have fucked you in the ass Saturday. You got a day Wednesday, baby. Ugh. He is creepy as hell. I mean, many learned men have disputed this, but in the 14th century, the Ron bomb, he like... Uh-oh, what now? Oh my god, these guys again. We want some money, Lebowski. You don't have the fucking girl, dipshit. We know you never did. So we take some money, you have fun, you uh, we call Shadifa. <laughs> Alright, alright. Uh, Why are these dudes, got, the, the uh, German guys, so hell bent on extorting, you know, the dude? Go after the rich Lebowski. Go after the rich Lebowski. Oh, God. Oh! Pull out a samurai sword. I fuck you! Fuck you! Oh! I fuck you! I fuck you! Take the four dollars! Take the four dollars! Oh, my God, is he Mike Tyson in him? Ah! He did the Mike Tyson. I fuck you! I fuck you! <laughs> Go on, Walter. We got me and Dad, dude. Oh no, what? Where's Donny? Oh, what happened, Donny? Huh? It's a heart attack. Oh God. Call the medics, dude. Pump and blood might pass out. We got help. Poor Donny. Jeez. Okay, so they're at ch this. Is this Treehorn's place? No. Who's this guy? You are the bereaved. He died? Donnie died. Alter subject. Oh man, Donnie. I understand you are taking away the remains. Oh Donnie, yeah. what a shame. However, we must of course transmit the remains to you in a receptacle. It's $180. Modestly priced receptacle. Is there a Ralph's around here? Oh God! Oh my God! They put him in a coffee tin. Oh, Donny, you deserved better. You deserved better than this. What a shame! I can't believe they just killed Donny like that. Donny was a good bowler and a good man. He was—he was one of us. He was a man who loved the outdoors and bowling. In your wisdom, Lord, you took him, as you took so many bright, flowering young men at Kaysan, at Landoc, at Hill 364. These young men gave their lives. Oh, Walter, this is about so Donny. Just good night, sweet prince. Just seems so, you know. Oh God. Oh my God. <laughs> you couldn't even do that, Walter. You couldn't even do that. Oh shit, dude. I'm sorry. <laughs> Goddamn wind. Oh, God damn it, Walter. <laughs> you fucking asshole. He really is. Dude, I'm sorry. I need the fucking travesty with you, man. <laughs> Sorry, it was an accident. Dude, I'm sorry. <laughs> this is so funny, man. He couldn't even scatter the ashes, like, in a dignified way. Fuck, Walter. Come on, dude. <laughs> what a nightmare. Hello. This movie must have, like, done so here. much for bowling. Good luck tomorrow. Yeah, thanks, man. Oh, sorry to hear about Donnie. Oh, yeah, well, you know, sometimes you eat the bar and sometimes, uh, you know. Hey, man. Oh, here we go. How do you do, dude? I wonder if I'd see you again. I wouldn't miss the semis. Oh, How yeah? things been going? Oh, you know, strikes and gutters, ups and downs. I'm sure I got you. Yeah. Mm, who is this guy? Thanks, Gary. Well, take care, man. Gotta get back. Sure. Take it easy, dude. Oh, yeah. I know that you will. Yeah, well... The dude of binds. <laughs> Who is he? The dude of binds. He I don't know about you, but I take comfort in that. It's good knowing he's out there. The dude. The dude. Taking her easy for all us sinners. I sure hope he makes the finals. Well, that about does her. Wow. Wraps her all up. What a story. Things seem to have worked out pretty good for the dude and Walter. They did. And it was a pretty good story. Although he lost his car. Don't you think? Made me laugh to beat the band. Parts, anyway. Mm. 
I didn't like seeing Donnie go. Same. But then I happen to know that there's a little Lebowski on the way. Oh, yeah. I guess that's the way the whole darned human comedy keeps perpetuating itself down through the generations. Mm Mm-hmm. Westward the wagons, across the sands of time until we... Oh, look at me. I'm rambling again. Well, I hope you folks enjoyed yourselves. Catch you later on down the trail. Wow, this was... uh, Say, friend. This was pretty interesting. Very unique. I've never seen a movie like this. Is he going to hit a strike? Strike! That was fun. Very interesting, man. I've genuinely never seen a movie like that. It kind of... I'm trying to think of anything similar that I've seen that was like that. Maybe Pulp Fiction. Maybe Pulp Fiction. It kind of had that kind of vibe. But this still was so unique. It was The characters were so different from your typical movie type characters. Walter, for me, the highlight of the movie has to be Walter, man. It, he is just, he. his character was so funny in a calamitous way. Like if I was, if I was the dude or Donnie or anyone connected with Walter, obviously you'd be having a terrible time because he, he's just, his decisions are just awful. But man, is he funny. That, that scene where he pulled out the gun, <laughs> he started waving it around. That it had me in stitches, and whenever he would tell Donnie to shut the, uh, you know, <laughs> and the scene, you know, where he was scattering Donnie's ashes, and like, he starts rambling about Vietnam, <laughs> genuinely hilarious, man. One of the funniest movies I've seen in a while. Honestly, I just really cool. I just don't know any other movie like this feel free to recommend some and i definitely will pick a few out and react to them because i really enjoyed this the perfect length you know like cool see um uh scenes and the the cinematography was cool it had that 90s california vibe yeah i really enjoyed this solid eight and a half out of ten thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in the next one